Hey guys, <coughs> hey guys, it's Lauren. Right off the bat, here are all of my socials and you should go follow them if you don't already. So for today's video, I am finally back with an undercover. The last undercover I did was back in August and I did TXT. And I really thought that K-pop was the most requested undercover video that I've ever gotten. Like, I didn't think anything could possibly top it until now. You guys have been so relentless in asking for a Total Drama Island undercover video, especially since you guys know my history with Total Drama. I used to be a huge fan. I ran an Instagram fan account in 2017 that I finally made public so you guys can make fun of me for that. I'm here to redeem myself in the Total Drama Island fandom and instead of just being a photo editor, of course I'm gonna be a video editor as well. So for today's video, I'm gonna be making a Total Drama editing account on TikTok for one week. We're gonna see how much I can grow the account, how many followers I can gain, and of course the most important part, making sure that none of you figure out that it's me. So today is day one, Monday. Enough said, we're gonna make the account. All right, setting up the account, I don't think this is the best nickname to have. I think people might figure out that it's me, so I have some stuff set up in my notes for the bio and display name. Something that I've never dabbled with is using those little like star symbols. I always just do like an emoji or something like that. So I chose a name that like feels fake because like, I don't know. I don't know. I couldn't come up with a normal name. So Venus is the name for this account. I feel like it also just matches with the vibes of like twinkly symbols. Like this is me trying to justify this. Anyway, yes dot Venus 637. Let's change the username. I've already decided on this. I don't like love it, but there's way more Total Drama edit accounts out there than you would think. Like literally they dominate the editing community on here. I'm just gonna go with totally dramas, but the O is an X. It just screams editing account username confirm okay and then for the bio I'm gonna do the same like character copy and paste thing wait that's actually kind of cute and then you all know my favorite characters are Courtney and Duncan like that's husband that's wife but I obviously can't brand this account as like a Duncan or Courtney stand because people know so I just arbitrarily chose two other characters to stand Heather and Izzy I love them of course and now we're gonna add the profile picture the quality is questionable but it's whatever it's just like a pretty account layout. It's, it's not sensory overload. Oh my god, I haven't done one of these in so long. I forget the order. Do I follow people and then post? Yes. No. No, I post and follow people so that when I follow people and they go to my account, they see that I post. I am going to post my first edit. Courtney's like, I'm a CIT. And then Heather's like more like a BIT. Wow, that's crazy. And then the audio is one that's like, Lady Boner Gong, ga ga ga, because it's that song that's like, he gave me the ick. You know that one that's popular on TikTok? I always try to use like trending audios for accounts like these, obviously, to get on the For You page. But I think I did a very good job though at being controversial with this, especially the end, because as you can see, I added a picture of Courtney with flies surrounding her with like a green background. Courtney, if you're watching this, you are still my favorite character. Let's choose a cover. I think it has to be this one. I'm gonna start all of my captions. Guys, I swear, I didn't look this up. Anyway, okay. I'm gonna start all of my captions with the little copy and paste symbol. Ew, why did it do that? So super cute and aesthetic, and then I'll say something like really mean. I'll be like, Court gave me the ick. Anyway, Stan, Heather for clear skin. First post, and then my hashtags, I guess? I think this is looking good. I'm ready to post it. Post. It's time to start following people. So let's look up total drama edit and just follow and like every single edit that I see on here. This is also always a very helpful part of the undercover videos because it kind of gives me like inspo. Not necessarily like, oh, I'm gonna copy this exact edit idea or these exact transitions, but it kind of just gives me a sense of like, these are the types of edits that do well in this fandom. It's different for, for all the fandoms, right? I'm also waiting patiently for a point in this video where I get follow blocked. That could have already happened. I'm just like, ignorance is bliss and I don't want to check because then I'll feel dumb. Ooh, I already got a follower from Littlest Pet Shop role play. Okay, period. Maybe I should make some Lilith's Pet Shop edits. What is this? That's not the show. Is that her wig? Oh God, he's fine. Thanks for following. Crying emoji. Wait, I'm scared, guys. 
Why did a fan page for me show up and it's followed by Littlest Pet Shop? This person said not really looking for moots already have 50 plus. I'm gonna still follow them and hopefully they follow me back. I take this so seriously, guys. I don't think I've ever been able to follow more than like 70 people when I first start the account and now look at me. I'm at two followers already and six likes. I got 86 views on the video I posted. Three saves, six likes, one comment. This is so underrated. I get a lot of these comments on the undercovers and they're so sweet, so let's respond. I'm gonna be so annoying, guys. I'm gonna be really annoying. I'm gonna use the little stars in my comment responses. I'm gonna say TY and then just paste it. That's so annoying, like. <laughs> so the time is currently 2.57 p.m. It's about to be three. I'm probably gonna follow some more people until I hit 200 because I never know when the follow block is gonna hit. I think this is gonna be a fun week, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. <laughs> Sorry, that was really disturbing. Hey guys, I'm back. Today is Tuesday day two and the time is currently 2 21 p.m. I posted my first edit yesterday and depending on how well that's doing I'll let that determine whether I'm gonna post my second edit today or tomorrow I know you guys like to stay updated on what new k-pop music I'm listening to twice okay okay I'm I'm not mad 15 followers eight likes Having more followers than likes is actually crazy. That never happens to me with these videos. But I think it was because I was able to follow so many people. So they were just following me back. But bro, y'all didn't want to check out my recent. I only got 136 views. Okay, eight likes and I got another comment. Why did this flop? Thank you, Lola. Thank you. I I'm wondering the same thing. Like, <laughs> aw, thank you. But yeah, I know I'm sad. Uh, I'm definitely not going to add the sparkles to this comment. I do not think it fits the vibe. So I'll just leave it at that. Let's see if I have any DMs. Okay, I don't. <laughs> That's fine though. I'll take charge of that. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. In violation of our community guidelines, what do you mean? Can I not DM anyone? So the only person this message actually sent to was this account. So I'm kind of stuck. I'm kind of stuck. Hey, I'm looking for new friends. I love Izzy too. What? Like, jet, what? Man, it's triggering comments on your videos. Yeah, I haven't gotten any triggering comments, but I am in fact triggered right now because why can't I send a single message? If you believe this is a mistake, tap feedback. Yeah, I'm gonna be tapping feedback. Feedback. They, you can't silence me. <laughs> That's so funny. I'm gonna be making friends regardless. Considering the dilemma of flopping and then being banned from messaging literally anyone, I think I'm gonna post again today. I need another edit up. I need to legitimize myself. Um, I can explain why I have five different pictures of Izzy's like torso and hips. It was, it was for an edit. The backstory for the one I'm posting now is actually pretty funny. I wanted to make an edit that wasn't necessarily like my idea or my song choice to make it less obvious. So I asked my best friend, Kate, who should I edit from Total Drama Island? What song should I use? Like what's going to be the vibe? And she told me her favorite character was the blonde girl with the boobs, the really hot blonde girl with the boobs. We all know who she's talking about. It's Lindsay, right? But for some reason I had a complete lapse in thought and I was like, oh, the blonde Blonde girl. She's talking about Bridget. So I made the entire base of the edit. Like I added a couple transitions and then I showed Kate and she was like, girl, she's not the one with the boobs. And I was like, oh, you are so right. And I'm so stupid, but I already made the entire base of this edit. So uh, tough luck. But anyway, with that backstory in mind, here's the edit. It's Snooze by SZA with Bridget, of course. And it's kind of like a softy, cutie, vibey. Like I don't even know the vibes of this edit. I just know that I really messed up and chose the wrong character, but I still think it looks cool. Yeah. With all velocity edits I do, I like to add like little transition touches. So like the intro and then I have this part and then also the part with like the heart that pops out. I think it's cute, but I think it's a good balance of simple, but also creative. I'll do that. Wait, I don't remember which sparkly I used for my caption yesterday. You know, I'll just choose a new one. I like this first one. It's cute. The softest girl who isn't appreciated enough. Guys, TikTok won't let me message anyone. How am I gonna make friends and grow? All right, I'll use the same hashtags as before. All right, are we ready to post? Post. Oh, I forgot that I mutual a fan page of myself. That's crazy. Love this, OMG. All right, the edit is up and now I do feel it is important for me to go spam comment sections because obviously I can't DM people. So this is the next best thing. Not my lane, but you're so talented. Mutuals, so obsessed with your edits. This is so good, I'm gagged. She's actually mother, like real. Their username is absolutely insane. Anyway, you're incredible moots. That was the first time I've said moots this entire video. I've been avoiding it, but it's a love-hate relationship. 
relationship I have with that word. Ooh, 10 notifications. 83 views, see? We're almost at the same amount of views as my first edit that I posted 24 hours ago. Interesting. Ooh, I got a comment. I love her, they did her so dirty in world tour. Season one, Bridge is my girl. Let me copy and paste these. See that? <laughs> I'm so pretentious. So on that note, I will see you guys later. Please wish me and this account and my DMs luck. We're gonna need it. I swear to you guys, the only moment of peace I get throughout my day is sitting down to film. That is my way of saying I am so done with school, but don't listen to me. Stay in school, kids. School is great. School is so fun. <laughs> hey guys, today is day three, Wednesday. The time is currently 2.46 p.m. I just got done with my classes for today. Hopefully we have the DM situation sorted out, but honestly, it's not looking that hopeful, even though I sent like 50 million reports. TikTok, DGAF at the end of the day, so. Okay, ooh, wait. Wait, that's actually kind of good. Okay. 32 followers, 85 likes. My first edit got like 50 more views exactly, but my recent got 718. So we haven't broken a thousand yet, but that's okay. I'm up for a challenge. Show them some love. This is an amazing edit. Aw. How is this not with at least 100k likes? What? Aw. Even if there's only two really nice comments, it always makes up for the lack of engagement. Like, even just one person telling me they love it makes my heart so happy. So, let's check out the, the DM situation. It worked. It worked. Do you play TRD? Yes. What about you? I, mm, should I research that? What is that? Oh, told you I'm a Roblox. I have before. I did a video on that. I'm so bad at it, LMAO, but it's so fun. I'm not posting another edit today. However, I will post something that's like kind of editing related. So I'm just using a clip from one of Courtney's confessionals and I'm trying to make like a relatable post. Not me. I couldn't care less. Not if I tried to care less. I do not care. So she's like, I don't care, I don't care, I don't care, but she obviously cares. I'll say me when my edit flops, and then in parentheses, I spent blah, 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 hours on it. Also, I'm like starting to hate my profile picture because I'm realizing like, there just has to be better ones. Listen, it's better than what I have right now because I don't even know why I chose that one. Anyway, I suck at the final challenges and jury vote. They never vote me for a jury. Me neither. And they say, want to play sometime? This one's going to have to be an empty promise. I feel bad about it, but... And yeah, definitely. That's all for today's check-in and I will see you guys tomorrow, Thursday. So I love teaching you guys how to use After Effects and different editing techniques. And the essence of my channel has always been not only to entertain, but to educate. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of online courses and members. It's a place to get inspired, learn new skills, and put them all together to work in impactful ways. Skillshare is the largest online learning community for creatives with such a wide range of topics. And this includes things like illustration and graphic design, to photography and music, and even marketing and productivity. They even have classes on animation, film production, entrepreneurship, web development, social media, basically all the things I do on here. So for any creative endeavor that you have, Skillshare is there to help. And what I really like about Skillshare is that it's kind of similar to my teaching style in the sense that it employs a learn by doing approach to teaching. After completing a class, you can create and share a project to show just how much you learned, just like you might watch my YouTube videos and tutorials and then go make an edit. It's also an on-demand platform with stackable lessons so you can learn entirely at your own pace. One Skillshare class that I'm really excited to check out is called Make AI Work For You, Break Creative Block. You guys know it is so hard to find inspiration as an editor sometimes. And when I have a creative block, it can be so hard to even open my computer and make anything. This course specifically shows you how you can use things like ChatGPT or Adobe Firefly to break a creative block. So the first 500 people to use my link in the description will get a one month free trial of Skillshare. If you have editor's block or no motivation, just hop on Skillshare, get that motivation and start editing. And who knows, maybe you'll be able to make five or six edits within a week like I do for these videos. All right guys, I will see you tomorrow for Thursday. It's days and moments like these where I'm very glad that I've never branded myself as a YouTuber who always looks like put together and pretty and makeup done and hair because <laughs> Baby, the weather is a reflection of my mood. It's 39 degrees and raining outside. You think I'm gonna get myself done up? For what? All right, guys, today is Thursday, day four. If I can do math correctly, we're like kind of at the halfway point. And I'm very excited for today because I'm posting the transition edit. Follow some people, of course. Okay, 41 followers, 130 likes. 
My recent meme video got 344 views. I'm kind of glad that it did not get more views than my second edit, but it did get more views than my first one, which is so, so lovely, of course. This is so good, OMG. Thank you, Brianna. Let me follow back. Oh, I am. Oh, I literally commented on her edit yesterday. How could I forget? Tyla sent a sticker. Oh, you're, oh, that's so cute. Wait, I'm gonna send one back. How do I search for GIFs though? Create sticker? I don't wanna create a sticker of my own edit. How do you search for GIFs, LOL? Brianna said, hey, oh my God, oh my God. Hey, how are you? Wanna be friends? Oh my God, I'm too eager with this. Okay, Natasha said hi, hi. Thank you so much for the support. It's so hard to grow as a small account, so all your love is really appreciated. I'm gonna DT you. Hey, hey, I don't know what to edit. Hmm. Oh my God, I've been re-watching Criminal Minds for the first time in like two years. This is a sign. Edit, Softy, Spencer, Reed, please. I love him. Okay, okay, Per. I feel like I have a lot of friends. This is fun. Ah. Time to post the transition edit. I know you guys love my singing, so I'll sing over this one for you. Rowdy, getting rowdy. Whoops, feeling like I'm a high school lur. Sipping on a warm wine cool lur. Hot, cause the party don't stop. I'm in a crop top like I'm working at Hooters. The song is Come On by Kesha, if you couldn't tell. I I cannot tell if this is like super Lauren core or like not Lauren core at all. I was trying to take inspiration from like total drama AMVs on YouTube that I used to watch when I was like 10 years old. If you guys are not familiar with those, I'll add a little example of what I mean. But so I was trying to like embody that just like if it had more graphs, you get what I mean? Wait, I feel like that's cool, right? Cause it shows Hooters, Yas. My mom said that this was her favorite part. Yes, I said my edits to my mom. You don't, gonna paste my sparkles. I'm gonna just do a song lyric for this. So I'm gonna do hot cause the party don't stop. And then I'll add my hashtags. Are we ready to post? Post. <gasps> Frick, no! I forgot to tag people. It's getting deleted. It's getting deleted by, oh my God. I've never done that before. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, are we ready to post again? Post. And I need to congratulate Natasha on hitting 100. So proud of you. Congrats. Me next. Okay, I'm very curious to see how this is gonna do within the first 10 minutes. So I'll get back to y'all in 10 minutes. I hate my life. It's been two minutes. It has been two minutes. Let me just, ah! My first comment on my recent edit after three views. You're Lauren. No! Nah! Oh, oh, they said slash Jade. They were joking, okay. Oh my God, I need to calm down. See, I panicked over this. I was gonna be so quick to respond like, what, what are you talking about? And then make myself look 10 times more guilty. Oh my God, that, that was a lot. Okay, wait, there's so many, there's so many comments already. Oh my God, you're Lauren, OMG, you're so talented. Fave editor ever, Lauren, I love this so much. So amazing, this eight. Oh my God, I'm shaking, this is so good. <laughs> Most talented edit ever, I love this. Going straight to my faves, Izzy, you are so sweet. Oh my god, another one. This is so good, OMG. They're coming in quick. Tyla liked it. Let's see what she has to say. I love craving validation from people I met like three days ago. She said, so good. Tyla said, hi, I told my boyfriend to follow you. Baha, thank you. That's dedication, truly. I'm gonna respond to the fave editor ever and say, there's no way. And then I'll respond to the Lauren comment and be like, bye. So I said, this is so good. I'm gonna say, you made my day. Sparkle. Okay, 100 views already. I'm up to 45 followers. And look at that ratio, it's delicious. And I have seven saves already. All right guys, I'll see you a little bit later. Who missed me? Also complete side note, recently I started watching Gossip Girl for the first time ever. Yes, I'm 20 years of age and have not watched it to this point, but low key when I'm doing these undercovers, I am Gossip Girl. Like who am I? That's a secret I'll never tell. Well, that's a secret I'll tell in about a week from now, but, but hi, today is Friday, day five. The time is currently 3.13 PM and I'm about to post my fourth edit. Yesterday we got our first couple of Lauren comments which terrified me so let's see if there's any more and if the transition edit got any more attention. Let me do my little following procedure as I always do. Oh! Oh, that's not, okay. You guys know me, I'm not an ungrateful individual, but for this transition edit to barely break 500 views is kind of crushing my soul right now. Okay, let's check it out though. 91 likes, 48 comments, see? The issue is TikTok not putting me on the For You page because one in every five person who's viewing it is also liking it, that's an insane ratio. If I have more viewers, I will have more likes and comments. Brianna and Natasha said so good. This is amazing, Moody. Love this. One of my fave mutuals edit on Jay. Stop it. Wait, so it said, honey, literally the next Lauren. <laughs> 
I, this is the second coming of Lauren. Y'all knew Lauren won. This is, I'm Lauren 2.0. Lauren coded, okay. So people are mentioning me, but not being like accusatory. They're more just being like, oh, this is so good. I think you're Lauren, which again, it's crazy to wrap my head around the fact that like calling someone Lauren or saying something is Lauren coded is like synonymous with like, this is really good. Like you guys just flatter me so much. I am not all that. I'm gonna respond to a couple comments. Let me get my sparkle copy and paste first. This better blow up. I wish. Paste. <laughs> I'm gonna respond to Jay's comment too because it's so nice. You're the sweetest person ever. Paste. Okay, now let's check my DMs. Hopefully I have some. Wanna be friends? Brianna said I would love to. Awesome. KK, okay, do you watch Total Drama? Cause I know she's like an Ari fan account. Thank you so much. I love to support small accounts and watching my moods blow up makes my day. That's the sweetest thing ever. I know as a small account, I have to be patient before expecting to blow up, but it's so awesome to have people like you by my side, aw. If you don't make friends in the edit community, what are you doing? Go make friends now. Wait, Izzy said, are you Lauren? How do I wanna play this? I'll tell her. I like telling at least one person before I give myself up. So I'll be like, if I blink twice in my next TikTok on Candice VFX, then yes. And I, I will I will make sure to blink twice at the beginning of my next TikTok video on Candace. Oh my God, the person whose boyfriend followed me. She says it's because he loved my Izzy edit. That's so nice. Baha, I wish my BF would also watch edits with me. JK, I do not have a BF. That's probably the most truthful thing I've said in this entire video. And I'm gonna wave to some new people as well. Okay guys, it's time to post another edit. It's a plot twist from Trent to Duncan to the song that's like, da da duck a beat, I was trying to beat a face. There wasn't made my now with some compassion. Da 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 duck a beat, I was trying to beat a case. But I ain't beat that cape, I did the race, yeah, yeah. Okay, that was like not on B, whatever. Um, Duncan is definitely on top. This is definitely my own opinion. But I think it's like the typical velocity style I usually do, but the transitions are definitely way quicker than I usually do them. So I don't think this is super, super lore encoded unless it actually is and I just have like editing dysmorphia. Okay, let's choose a cover. No, that's cool, that's cool. It's bright, it's fun, it's giving green screen. So let's paste. This is gonna be a dumb caption, like I can't think of anything else. I'm gonna say, there's only one man for Gwen and it sure ain't Trent. Now listen, I do not, ugh, I do not ship Gwen and Duncan at all. So really swallowing my pride for this caption. Oh, and I'm gonna tag people. I need to not forget that. Are we ready to post? Post. Oh, I like how that looks with my feed too. Cause it's like, ah, ah, ooh, ah, ooh, ah, ooh. I will check back in with you guys at a later time because I need to go to Trader Joe's now, immediately. Okay, see y'all. Hey, I'm back and I don't remember what day it is. Today's day six. Saturday and the time is currently 2 54 p.m. And I'm not posting an edit today I'm posting my last one tomorrow But of course I'm gonna check on the account and see how my edit from yesterday is doing. Can you hear Derek singing in the shower? Oh my god, wait, wait, that's good, right? Follow, 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 follow. Oh, it says follow back instead of just follow. That is a good sign, right? 115 followers, 500 likes. My recent, yes! I finally broke a thousand views. I'm so happy about this. My recent got 1,050 views, 211 likes, and 42 comments. Let's look through them. Trent, my love. Oop, I'll say bahaha, sorry, wait. Y'all already know what I'm missing. Boom. Underrated, so good. This is so good, you're so underrated, it's unreal. Mutuals, OMG, this is actually insane. Yes, I completed the moot. Smiley, sparkles. Underrated AF, love this. Oh my God, another person asked me to be mutuals. Done. Izzy knows that it's me, if she believes it. Your editing style is everything, oh. Hey, dunk me on top. I agree, but I don't agree for the purposes of this video. That's definitely an opinion. Sparkles, LOL. Oh, why isn't this viral? Underrated, you're so insanely underrated. How is this bot ferial? I don't know why it's bot ferial, but the talent, this A, underrated. Oh my God, the 3D transition. Thank you. Yes, yes, underrated, underrated, underrated. So talented, this edit is amazing. OMG, what, how is this flopping? I'll say maybe I'm Shadow band? Question mark. Sparkle? What the hell? This is so underrated. Oh. So, like, besides the fact that I guess, like, looking at it objectively, it kind of flopped, the comments always make up for it. Like, everyone is being so sweet. And that's always the part that matters. So, the Bridget one is almost breaking a thousand views. Oh, someone said it's their 59,316th time watching this. That's so nice. Girl, this needs more attention. I love everyone here. Wait, Natasha tagged me in her post. My dream vid. I'm gonna say this is me contributing because she wants, what is it? 60 plus comments. We will get there. Everyone, please go 
go to lola's.td. Oh wait, this isn't even Natasha's video. I guess she was just trying to help someone out. Regardless, everyone go to Lola's TD and make this video blow up. KK, do you watch Soul Drama? I didn't get to. Ooh, no, why? <laughs> Izzy tagged me in a post. I'm gonna say I swear it is me. I never ended up posting a TikTok on my main yesterday because I'm not gonna lie, I was watching Gossip Girl. But anyway, I will make sure to do that today. Your edits are awesome though. If you could only choose three TD characters from all seasons, who would you choose? Mine would have to be, it'd be Duncan, Courtney, I think Alejandro, is that a hot take? No, I'm, I'm literally a liar. It'd be Courtney, Duncan, Lashana. Oh my God, I love Lashana. Paulina said, I've been scrolling on Pinterest for hours. I'll say, how about I give you an audio? Ooh, and you can choose mine for my edit tomorrow. Deal? Yay. Okay, I need to think of a good song. I'm just exposing myself right now. I'm gonna say use Agora Hills by Doja Cat for a softy Spencer edit. I have like this favorite thingy. I'll find one. Yay, thank you. Paulina said I might TBH. Ah, tag me when you post. Okay, right now I'm gonna do another post that is more like a meme post. It's just a clip from the show. So I'm gonna use a clip of my favorite song from Total Drama World Tour. And that's just gonna be the post. This is just gonna be like, yeah, this is my favorite song. So the song I chose is Sierra's when they're in Paris and she's like, Cut me back my hand and chewed it up, spit it out, and then said, I threw it down, so call names and then laugh. The level of bars, it's like the only other person who can compete is like Nikki or Ice Spice or something. It's just chef's kiss. Anyway, so I'm gonna be funny with it. I'm gonna say, you better not be the best Total Drama World Tour song when I get back. Am I the only one with this problem? TikTok does this weird thing now where it's like, oh, like we're not gonna put a word on the same line. The line doesn't fit the word best. So we're gonna take the T and put it on the next line. And then that makes so much aesthetic visual sense. Like what? Why would I want this? And how do I fix it? Argue with the wall sparkles <laughs> and then add my hashtags. All right, are we ready to post? Post. Guys, go follow this account, they're so underrated. I love you, Natasha, oh my god. I'm gonna say fave mood, fave mood, I love you. Someone commented, of course, their edits eight. Oh my god, I'm gonna follow you back, Leah. All right, guys, we have another meme post up. Finally surpassed a thousand views. <laughs> so I guess things are looking up as the week is coming to an end. Hey guys, I'm back. Today is Sunday, day six, and the time is currently 8.28 p.m. Yes, it is a lot later than my other checkups, but that is because I did not have an edit ready. So I started editing at like one or 2 p.m. and I just finished it now. I decided I wanted my last edit to be a transition edit because the account is like low key flopping compared to my other undercovers. So I'm like, might as well go out with a bang. The first transition edit I posted kind of flopped. So hopefully this is a good rebound. Okay. Okay, okay. I have 151 now, almost 600 likes. My recent got 100 views. Not 100, 160. Three comments, okay. For real, Eli said, the sparkle emojis, Eli, why are, we, why are you making fun of me? Break your heart and chew it up, it's been a period. My recent edit is still kind of at like the same place, over 200 likes and 50 comments. Oh, Lola's TDR followed me back, slay. Underrated account, that is so nice. And here are my other stats for y'all to look at. I have two edits that surpassed a thousand views, so slay. Oh no, oh no guys. I completely forgot to check Paulina's DM giving me an edit audio. I did, I, I just used whatever audio I felt like, oh no. Bro, I'm so sorry, I forgot we talked about audios and just chose a random one for my next edit. The skull emoji. Let's see what she gave me though, heavy metal lover. Okay, I like this audio, but that's more so I feel like for a velocity edit and I was trying to make a transition edit. So now I don't feel as bad, but thank you again, Paulina. Oh, this person DM'd me first, 20K followers. Whoa. <laughs> Hi, what's up? Wanna be friends? Okay, Tyler responded with her favorite characters. Heather, Courtney, and uh, Gah, uh, uh, Kitty. So valid. I forgot that Kitty existed. Okay, now let's post the final edit of the account. This one was heavily, heavily inspired by old Total Drama AMVs I used to watch. I actually used a song that I literally only know from the AMVs I used to watch. It's the song Pretty Little Psycho, and I feel like you definitely need to be a certain age to remember that song because it's a pretty throwback one, but so it goes, Make me, make me obsessed. 
Da, da, oh, 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 here we go. Walking, talking like you know I want your pretty little sinner. Okay, here's the thing. I think this is minute past, okay? There's just something about it that I'm like, oh, this is off. I think it's because I was rushing it. Like, usually I try to get my edits done by the end of the night, but since I wanted to post today, I don't think it's like my best material, but it's not horrible. It's not horrible. Also, I messed up with the drop shadow at this party. It's such a nitpicky thing, but like, I forgot to add like soften to it, so it just looks weird. But again, I'm my own worst enemy, so. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna use that for the thumbnail. She's looking crazy. Okay, pasting my sparkle things. This is low key a rushed scrap, so don't judge. LOL, LOL, LOL. Let me add my hashtags. Are we ready to post? Oh wait, no, we're not. I need to remember to tag people. Done. Are we ready to post? Post. Oh, I also forgot to tell you guys, I finally posted the video on my main Candice VFX where I like blinked twice at the beginning. So I think it's safe to say that Izzy confirmed knows that it's me. Oh wait, that thumbnail did not, no. That did not work out the way I thought it would. Okay, <laughs> Paulina said same, next time I'll use your idea. At least we both forgot. Okay, that makes me feel better. All right guys, tomorrow is Monday, which means it's the last day of the account. Hopefully I can get closer to 200 followers, but I'm not gonna hold my breath. I'll see you guys tomorrow. It's the last day. All right, guys, today is Monday and the time is currently 3.39 p.m. It's been exactly a week since I made the account, so let's do our final check-in. Last I remember, I was at like 150-ish followers. Okay, we are we are still at that. Frick, my recent only got 110 views. To be fair, it was kind of ass, oop, but <laughs> 23 likes and 20 comments, not a bad ratio. Oh my God, this is crazy, how? You're literally my favorite TV editor, you're so good. Y'all already know what I'm gonna say to that. <laughs> Thank you, you're so sweet. Oh my God, this eight, I love Gwen. This is amazing, oh my. Another edit, another vid that makes me happy. I love you, Natasha. I love you. Y'all share this edit, it's amazing, oh my God. Thank you, like, I do think we need to be sharing this. What the heck, this is so good. Why isn't this viral? Why isn't this viral? Okay, two of them. Again, at the end of the day, the comments are always the part about the video that makes me the happiest. But I guess we'll look through some ending stats. So this was definitely my least viewed and least liked edit. Then this is my most viewed edit. I got 1,300 views, 240 likes, and 56 comments. Then this one, which is the first transition edit, 118 likes, 61 comments. My meme post has more likes than my recent edit. Okay. On this one, I got 118 likes and 19 comments. And then on my first one, 50 likes, 12 comments. So at least I got over 100 likes on a couple of them. Woo! I think the standards for this video were definitely different from standards from past videos. I'm gonna check my DMs for the final time too. Your edits are so good, OMG, I'm actually obsessed. Wow. Like they just randomly messaged again at 3 p.m. to tell me my edits are so good. That's so nice. You're such a sweetie. I feel so bad because you're flopping, dude. It's unfair. Thank you, Izzy. Thank you. Like, girl, me too. Hopefully y'all still enjoy the YouTube vid. I think this is my favorite conversation of the entire video. I'm sorry, hearts for Lindsay. I couldn't come with the energy that you needed. Or maybe, maybe we just matched each other's energy. It's safe to say this has been my least successful undercover account ever. But you know what? I'm gonna take this as a learning experience because I think I needed to be humbled. I needed to flop to see what to do differently for next time. And the consensus that I came to is I don't know what I could have done differently. Like, <laughs> I made five decent edits, like, and hey, maybe they weren't my best edits, but I'm so proud of the fact that I did what needed to be done. I made awesome friends and mutuals who, when no one else wanted to support me, they were supporting me. I avoided getting caught because not enough people saw the account, but again, I hit all of the objectives. So moral of the story, maybe right now the editing community is not a good market to get into because not to say 159 followers is bad, but again, other undercover experiences have showed me it's definitely possible to gain more than 160 followers within a week. However, I've been so grateful for my time in the total drama fandom. Everyone is just as nice and supportive as I expected them to be, and I think it's a great fandom to edit in. All right, guys, that's all for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. And the only question I have for you now is, did I trick you? And the answer is actually inconclusive because I don't even think you guys knew this account existed. But anyways, the undercover shit were fun as ever and remember to always stay on the lookout for me. I could be undercover again right now for all you know. All right guys, I hope you have a great day or night wherever you are and bye. I keep it undercover.